here with head coach Steve Samara. Samara, you coming off a uh, fifty-one to three romping here in the preseason? I mean, uh, you kind of ex it is preseason football, but at the same time, you must be happy with the win. Absolutely. You know, I thought our guys, uh, top to bottom, played great offense, defense, and you know, special teams. We got a score there as well. I, you know, uh, for an exhibition game and is playing as many guys as we did, yeah, completely happy. Up in the press box, Jameek Taylor was jumping all around during that kickoff return. I think he's, I think he was happy to maybe see his kickoff reps reduced. What was the th your thought on your backup returner? Uh, pretty good. I mean, we knew Melvin uh, right from the start had the speed and athleticism to uh, to be that guy. He just needed, uh, we just need to see him live. We knew what Jamie could do, so uh, now we're a, we're a dual threat there, and uh, yeah, teams will be scared to kick to us. That's for sure. It was a musical uh, musical chair as a quarterback today. It's uh, we're still trying to figure out Creighton, Mills, or Blewett. Uh, who impressed you today? Well, to be honest with you, I was quite impressed with all of them. I thought when they each one got in there for their first series, you know, the, they were a little jumpy. The pressure was on. We put the heat on them to tell them that, you know, we got to make some decisions. I think our biggest thing now is go back, evaluate the film, sort of find out who's who's going to do what, and uh, and run and go from there. So you guys have uh, Mount Allison next week. They lost 23 nothing to uh, Santa Vex here in the preseason. Uh, what's your thoughts on that matchup next week? Well, being the first game of the regular season, uh, you know, the reality is anything can happen. And uh, I take the preseason, uh, you know, with a grain of salt. And, you know, it's the same kind of thing here. You know, uh, Katie, I thought, started the game very well against us. And, you know, a break or two here, some penalties, you know, just some, uh, you know, lack of experience plays. Uh, same thing could have happened to Mount A down there for sure. No, uh, no serious injuries coming out of this preseason game. One of the big aspects of preseason football, make sure everyone stays healthy. Yeah, as far as I can see right now, we've, uh, we're have we pretty clean and healthy. And, uh, you know, we get back about six guys that we uh, that we rested this week. So, uh, you know, we're pretty ecstatic about that. First time preseason in about 10 years for the AUS. What's your thoughts on an actual preseason game? Oh, it's fantastic. You know, the opportunity to evaluate guys with, uh, you know, when the bullets are live is uh, incredible. And uh, for us to be able to get that, uh, you know, kudos to the conference for uh, for stepping up and allowing that to happen. I'd be remiss if I didn't ask. I know the preseason's ending in the NFL. You get to watch any Dolphins, and what's your thoughts on the what's your thoughts on our Miami Dolphins so far this year? Well, I'll tell you. You know, I, I'm I'm not the biggest Chad Henney fan, but uh, you know, they're winning games, uh, scoring 15 and 17 points, and uh, I just don't think that can uh, that can't cut it in the NFL. You you got to be able to score some points, and uh, you know, my fingers are crossed and uh, and my toes, but uh, I'm, I'm not hopeful in that tough AFC East. I got fingers and, cr uh, and toes crossed for the Hen for Henny, but I think our defense will be all right this year with the young the young the cornerbacks there. Uh, the defense is great. You know, uh, I think they're going to be able to hold teams to under 14 points. You know, can we get 15? That's going to be the question. <laughs> that, that, definitely the question. <laughs> Thanks, Coach.